Welcome to day 19 of Tadpole Cam. Um, we've taken a few days off because the tadpoles aren't quite developing as fast now, so there's less changes with each day. But what I want to show you in today's video is the size they are. So you can see a round object, the shadow of it, in the left hand corner, the top left hand corner of the screen just there. And that is a five pence coin. And that gives you something to measure the size of the tadpoles against. So you can take out a five pence coin from your pocket, or your parents' pocket, and look at it. And you'll then be able to see how big the tadpoles are in relation to that, that object. And this is called using a scale. So you're taking a known object and comparing it to the size of the animals you're seeing. And you'll see that at the moment, the tadpoles are about the same length as the width of a five pence coin. You can just see a few of them swimming across the screen there. There's a nice one just passing under the five pence coin. And that's the size they've got to. And if you remember, I'm just going to put the pointer back in the screen. If you remember when we started off, there's the pointer. When we started off, the eggs were about the same size as the end of that pointer, and as were the tadpoles when they first started growing. So that's how much they've changed in size over the last, um, it's just over three weeks now. And they're going to continue changing in size and growing as they continue to develop. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to cut some large tadpoles that we've got. I'm going to put the same five pence coin in, uh, in the shot, and you'll be able to see how big they are. And that will give you an idea of how big these tadpoles are going to get as their development continues. So here we go. Here are larger tadpoles. And these are about a week to ten days older than the ones that we are watching at the moment. We have the same five pence piece in shot right here. And this gives you an idea of the scale. We can compare these to our um, the ones that we are watching. You can see how much bigger these ones are their heads and their bodies are already about half the size of the five pence coin and their overall length they're maybe about one and a half times the width maybe even two times for some of them the width of the five pence coin so you can just see the ones on either side of it there and this shows how much our tadpoles are going to grow the ones that we're watching are going to grow over the next week to ten days to start catching up with these ones in fact these ones are big enough that we're going to expect them to start growing legs and start changing into frogs soon. But for the moment, we'll go back to the tadpoles we are following. So this is us back with the tadpoles we are following now. And I won't do another video for another couple of days. Uh, but when I do, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start adding information in, not just about our tadpoles that we're following, but also about how other frogs and other amphibian species develop and reproduce. And there's some really interesting variations you get. What we have here, these are tadpoles from um, the common European frog. But we'll see as we look at other species, they've got very different shapes of frog spawn. Very different types of tadpoles and they live in very different ways. So we'll add that information in so you can see exactly what happens with other species of frogs, toads and other amphibian species from around the world. 